Recently, Thrasher Commercial had the privilege of helping restore the historic Burlington train station here in Omaha. Let's take a look at what part Thrasher Commercial played in helping to restore and strengthen this landmark structure that was originally constructed in 1898. The local ABC television affiliate recently acquired an historic abandoned train station to be remodeled as a state-of-the-art broadcast and web media facility. This remodel included the re-support of an interior multi-width brick wall. This wall had been originally supported by a continuous pair of steel channels spanning between brick piers spaced roughly 10 feet along the length of the wall. The project designers proposed removing the steel channels to support the existing wall on a continuous grade beam supported by a deep foundation system. Due to the limited access and working area, helical piles were chosen as the ideal deep foundation solution. The helical piles consisted of a two inch square bar lead section transitioning to a three and a half inch round shaft material, also called a stinger, with an 8, 10, 12, 14 helix plate configuration. This stinger lead section was used to help the piles advance through cobbles previously identified in the soil profile and to also help the piles penetrate into an anticipated bedrock layer consisting of weathered shale. The installed piles were cast into T-shaped concrete saddle beams spaced along and perpendicular to the existing wall. The T-shape of the beams was required to avoid the existing brick piers and involved installing two helical piles on one end and a single helical pile on the other to resist the asymmetrical loading on the beams. With the saddle beams constructed, steel I-beams were placed through holes made through the wall. Hydraulic jacks were then placed to support the ends of the I-beams, thereby unloading the original steel channels beneath. The channels were subsequently removed and a new concrete grade beam was constructed to transfer the wall load to the new system. To learn more about this and other Thrasher projects, visit us at www.gothrashercommercial.com and click on the Case Studies tab.